Hey everybody, James Yeager, Clyde Seltzer here. Uh, today we got the Tehran Tactical, the Tehran Tactical guns. And uh, we're gonna shoot them and compare them. This is the 19, the, the Wicked 19 uh, uh, I, from John Wick 2. This is, I gotta be careful. This oh. is not the gun from John Wick 2. You told 2. me it was the gun. No, oh, I did okay. not. All right, all right. <laughs> uh, but this is uh, you know, a model after that. And same with the 34, uh, except this one's got the Holo Sun on it and uh, uh, enforced light. And uh, before anybody asks me how the Hollow Sun or the Enforced Light are working, I'm, I haven't put many rounds through them, so I have no report. I haven't put many rounds through these, so this will be the first official report. I've shot them a little bit, let other people shoot them, but Clyde and I are going to just kind of shoot them and just kind of get some get somebody else's input on these two guns. So we're going to do that right now. So Clyde is uh, going to shoot. I, I guarantee he's going to shoot for the head because that's oh, that, right. he's a head shooter. That's what he does. So he's going to shoot the John Wicked 34. Go ahead. <laughs> and he's pro right now he's probably thinking, why didn't I give him uh, better ammo and so what we're shooting is a, a can of ammo with like all kinds of different ammos in it and so i don't know there's a couple sounds different sounds in there <laughs> most I, of them went boom it was okay well like people have a handful of ammo yeah, yeah. at the end of class they don't want to fly with it they throw up my can and so i don't know what the hell's in there sometimes but uh, so 34 uh what did you think about it that's sweet i mean it's almost the so, recoil is almost down to nothing. It's almost it's cheating. It's light. It's yeah, it's cheating. It's cheating. That's why I just got towards the end there. I was like, I was like, forget the groups because I'm just going to shoot it fast. And right. See what's going on with and it. And so um, now you shoot the 19, so you have a back-to-back -back comparison. Okay. And see how you like that. All right. <laughs> well, what about it? That's the easy button. <laughs> so I actually it? like the trigger on this one better than I do that one. I wonder what the difference is. I don't know. Probably nothing. Just me. But uh, looking different. Well, the outside's not any different now. Got the smooth face. Boy, something about the reset on this one though—it just feels like it's just just razor, razor thin or tight or whatever. Well, if I'm using the good words. I don't. You don't feel that? No, I mean, they're both great. Yeah, they're both great. That's, that's, uh, I, did, like, I didn't feel a like, difference. You know, beautiful and gorgeous. I mean, they're both, <laughs> it's both pretty good. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll shoot now. I'll shoot the, I'll shoot the 19 first and then uh, steal another mag from him. I got one here. Like, I don't even know what this is. Okay. You ready? <laughs> well, I'll shoot the 19 you got first. That one? Okay, I got okay. a mag. Uh, I'll shoot the, uh, the B zone and a uh, shout out to Shoot Steel on the, on the, uh, B zone uh, on the target here. Uh, they uh, they did a good job making those for us. Sometimes it goes off before you think it does. Oh boy, yeah. <laughs> very very light trigger. I was getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice, man. Nice little. Oh, yeah, it's got a wicked good trigger on it. Uh, see? Wicked. 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 Oh, that's right. Hey. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> <laughs> now I'll shoot the. This Hollow Sun sight is still not zeroed. <laughs> no. Were you using the sight? Uh, I was. It was kind of a little off. Uh, little, maybe a little left, but not, not horrible. Okay, I'm going to shoot at the C. A little to the left. left. <laughs> what a neat gun. So, so the Wicked 19 and the Wicked 34. What, what do you? If you if you had to pick one, you know, strange enough, I think I like that one better. Just just do. I think because you're probably 
in a more practical sense, you might be like, I'll carry that motherfucker. <laughs> Probably, yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, but uh, um, I don't know what uh, what Taryn says about about these as, as carry guns, but my my philosophy is typically don't do anything to the guts of the gun, like yeah. put sights on it and, and run it like that. And there are other acceptable things like he was talking about for a for a duty carry revolver he sent it back to smith and wesson performance center to have the duty the duty job done to it yeah the duty trigger job yeah. and he carried that gun on duty and stuff like that but anyway uh but the, there's no doubt that these guns shoot so uh man uh <laughs> what do you like better which one do you like better i like that one better, you like that one better. <laughs> just, that's just got all the, the stuff on it just like you know, yeah, you know, I, I like the, I love that hollow sun dot side on it, and uh, I think I could get used to that. You know, I just not used to it yet. You know what I mean? Like so I'm an old guy. So the reticle so. on it right now is like the old style EOTech reticle. Yes, yeah. But you can put just a dot in there. Okay. Like you can change it, and I don't know how to do that, but. <laughs> <laughs> but if there's an instruction manual on you can do that. You can figure that out uh, yeah. basically if you had to, you can yeah. come over there. Okay. But uh but uh shout out to Tran and, and uh and, and, and mostly all the girls that shoot with him. You ladies are beautiful. <laughs> but uh but no, uh, we're gonna I'll we'll do some more stuff with this and, and and if you if you wanna borrow them and shoot a competition or something and report back or For anything. A year or so or any, anything, <laughs> anything about I'm used to not getting stuff back <laughs> ever, so if I got it back in a year I don't be, live far enough away from you to get away with that though, you'd be up at my house. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but uh, anyway, these they're they're fun, and if you're a competition shooter, I, I can't see you not liking these things, man. Oh, yeah. um, Either you know, one of them. They're Jordan Winkler would say sweet trigger hashtag mm -hmm. sweet trigger mm -hmm. on these things, but but uh, I'm running the uh, uh, the uh, uh, XS F8s on this. I, I if you want if you like a, a notch and post uh, if you like a notch and post sight, uh, I can I can recommend recommend these without hesitation. They they're great. I still got big dots on my carry stuff, but. Uh, but if you like the notch and post, the 490 degree angles, I can recommend those. Mm -hmm. um, and the uh, the uh, base plates are, are are wicked. And I don't know if the, I think they're like plus plus 15. The, I think the, I think they're like plus 15 rounds or something. They hold a lot of bullets. <laughs> My arm was getting tired but towards the end of the magazine. It was all right. It hold a bunch. But uh, so I guess that's it. Well, I'll, I'll shoot these things some more, and I'll shoot them through some classes and stuff like that. But just in general, they're a lot of fun to shoot. They're very accurate. They're very controllable. Mm -hmm. You know, all that stuff. Oh yeah. And that whole sun sight's nice and mm -hmm. all that good stuff. So James Jagger and Clyde reporting from Tactical Response. Your responsibility to be ready for the fight never ends. <laughs>